Now let's do a more extreme example. I've got a 10 ohm load, which is way smaller than the 50 ohm load, without a buffer. So now the buffer is here instead of here. Here we've got the amplifier. I'm going to attach the load. Watch what happens. Ouch, that's pretty bad. Now let's try feeding the signal into the other configuration. In the other configuration, we've got the buffer second. So now my signal's coming into the second circuit. And the question is, what happens when we load down this circuit? Let's observe the output before the load is put there. Okay. And now what happens when we short the load down? It still doesn't care. So you can see it gets a bit noisier, but it can handle sourcing that current even for the 10 ohm.